Hello guys, my name is Shostanand, welcome back to me, playing Earthbound. In the last episode, we defeated the boss of Looming Hall, uh, Electro Spectre, and we got this seventh melody. And in attempting to escape Looming Hall, we found ourselves in this underground cavern of dinosaurs that's tended to by the Tenda. The Tenda tend the dinosaurs. The, the, this, this whole Tenda thing is just getting me all. Tenda just seems like a it's just like a good word for like, like just like puns. Like I tend to think that Tenda is a good word, and tend dinosaurs. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. It's just me. I like the I like Tenda. I like the Tenda. Tenda's cool. The Tenda are cool. And then we got a talk to a talking rock that we were supposed to talk to, and he told us nothing of value basically. But he did tell us where to go in this underground cavern, so we are now going to head southwest, which is actually the opposite direction that I was actually going, because I was planning on going southeast, but it's actually southwest. Uh, here's one of those, oh, we can't go that way, okay. Uh, can we get this geyser to activate? How do we get this geyser to activate? Is there a way to get this geyser to activate, or do we just hang around? We just, we just hang around, okay. Did that heal us? Are we healed? No, we're not. How do you wh how do you use these things? Screw screw you guys. Uh, let's see what this Tenda has to say. He the dinosaurs don't attack, don't come and attack me, so I can relax. Except now I can't get out. That's that's a problem. I just remembered. I think the Chomposaurus has dropped something valuable. I don't want to fight two enemies at once. I think he's stuck behind a tree. Yeah, we can fight just one at a time. Cool. What knows a source is not a problem at all. And by not a problem at all, I mean. Ooh. And by not a problem at all, I mean he does like 50% of Paula's health. Never mind, now he only does like 30% because I gave her. Uh, some really good weapons or defensive items lately last episode so she will survive she will survive hey hey all right uh, let's see what you've got for us I'm still pretty sure you drop a valuable item and I would like to see if I can get it um, we're going to not bash because you start with a shield which is really weird to me still Uh, goods, neutralizer, yeah. Okay, freeze, yep. Okay. Solidified, perfect. Not gonna do anything this turn. Great. And able to move again, sure. But that's fine, because we can now spy on you. And let's see what you've got. Or we can just kill you before I get a chance to spy. We're going to kill you before you get a chance to spy, aren't we? No, I still get to spy on you. Oh, he's got a present. Magic pre Yo! What? What? I knew it had a rare drop, and I just got- I just got- I just stole it by- by spying on him. It's the second one I fight. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Jeff! Jeff, you're cool. I like you, Jeff. Jeff, I'm sorry for saying that you weren't as cool as I thought you were last episode. Paul leveled up. Woo! Shoutouts to Jeff. Doing the work. Alright, what do we got? We got the magic frying pans. All obviously it's only for Paula. Um Do we need this lucky coin still? Uh, we don't need this talisman ribbon. This is not as good as uh, whatever the Saturn ribbon that she currently has. So we can go ahead and give her this. Oh, and we can now equip. Which will do... What? What? It's worse? 
Jeff, you suck! Jeff, the one thing you were supposed to be good at! You didn't even get a good weapon! Why, game? Why would you make the rare drop worse than something you can obtain earlier? That's dumb. Alright, we are we are now in the fire sanctuary. So let's see. Oh, there's some fire you guys here. Fire guys, let's see what we got. Uh psychic psycho and major psychic psycho. Uh I'm gonna go with weak to ice. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. That was not that was not right. How do I turn that off? How do I turn that off? Okay, that was only one turn. Um Okay, that that wasn't bad, but I, I'd still not do, rather not do that again. You have a shield now. Frick. Just keep bashing and spy and keep bashing. Oh! We, uh, we didn't even get a chance to spy because we kicked their butts too fast. Thanks, auto fight. We got speed capsule. Jeff takes it. Let's go ahead and use this speed capsule on Pooh. So I would like, because Pooh is our backup healer, and I would like him to be a bit faster. Ness obviously doesn't need it, because he's got the, the rabbit's foot right now, and Paula... Ah, eh, Paula could use it, I guess, but it doesn't matter. Okay. And I guess I could use it on Jeff, too, because he's the slowest guy. But, again... Eh, whatever. Successful to brain shock. Okay, interesting. Lots of damage. No damage. Lots of damage. Lots of damage, nerve, decent damage. Let's just kill you and stop this health rolling. Alright. Alright, I I don't even know what Brain Shock does. We never use it. Uh, okay. How, what's health at? You could use a heal. You could use a heal. You could use a heal. Everyone needs a heal. We don't need enough. We don't have... It's not really worth it to use uh, Omega, though, is it? Because this is... Yeah, is it more efficient to use, to have not used... We only used 18 PP instead of 24, so it was probably better to do it this way. Which way do we go? Probably not this way. More enemies, sure, sure. Major Psycho and Psycho Psycho. Uh, let's go ahead and see what Brain Shock does. Where's Brain Shock? Nest doesn't have Brain Shock. I could have sworn Brain Shock was a Nest move. Wait. Why doesn't anyone have Brain Shock? Is Brain Shock a poo move? It is! Okay. Let's see what this does. Oh, he confuses him. Okay. So they're weak to being confused. But it didn't work. It didn't stop him from using fire on us. And now he's dead, so... Oh, wait, he's not dead. Now he... Now! Now he's dead! Okay, well... Jeff leveled up. Nice. Uh, go ahead and life up on Pooh. Nope. And go ahead and life up on Jeff. Oh, is this the right way? Well, that was the right way. We don't want to go that way. No, I don't want to fight enemies, though. Come on. I just fought these guys. I don't want to have to fight them again. Frick. Like, I literally just fought them. And now I'm going to have to fight them a third time when I come back in here to go the right way correctly.
Oh. Okay, the spring shock does not work on the big guy. Oh no, this is not going well because they have fire and. Cool. Cool. I did not mean to attack uh, that guy with Ness, but I'm glad I did, because that worked out. Ness leveled up. Oh, baby, offensive by three. Everything else was good. Okay, cool. That was an easy fight. It was great. Fine. I would still not... I would still rather not fight all these enemies I don't need to fight. Ugh. Oh, oh. Soul-consuming flame. Okay. I I would imagine. No, he's Oh, okay. Not very defensive, I see. Boo leveled up. Cool. Very minimalist level up. Dead in that way. So the 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 rope up here is the fun way. First we have to fight another enemy. The the, the spawn rate in here is too high. Okay, do I get to actually... No, I too shot him. Wow. I don't even need to spy on this guy. He's just so bad. Oh. Evil Elemental. That looks like the guy... That's the guy from the... That broke Pooh's legs in his vision. Get the frick out of here! Oh, no, I missed. <laughs> Pooh, Pooh is too afraid to try. Oh, but he's too afraid to try. Oh, to hurt Pooh. Vulnerable to fire, vulnerable to flash, open to hypnosis. Okay. Well, I don't think we're going to need it now, because we've already started hurting you. So we should be fine. Yeah, you're good. You're dead. Okay, well, we got to be careful about that guy, because he might give Pooh some Vietnam flashbacks. More enemies! Woo! Yay! Um. Uh, let's go ahead and kill you first, so we're not worried. Because I'm pretty sure you're probably going to be like a glass cannon type guy. It's a really good thing that I gave Paulo that freaking rain pendant, because or the sea pendant or whatever it is she has, because we really need her to not die and like. All these fire attacks that she's just like shrugging off. Really big deal. Alright, let's just let's just jump into it. No, we got some put some food. We got some food. This is what food is for. Oh right, poo doesn't work frick. Ah. I forgot the frickin' I forgot Pooh doesn't heal from food like the rest of us do. I can give him some rice gruel. Or not! It's not Western food! You you brought it with you when you frickin' started this game! Frick you, Pooh. You're worthless. Ah. Uh. Oh, snap. I forgot you get PP from that, too. We're gonna use beta on poo. And alpha on Jeff. Okay, let's go. Let's get this item. I'll take that. I will take that. Bag of Dragonite. If you, if we didn't... The, the screen is lagging there, so I mean... How did we just get a back attack? Like, the, the screen... Oh, God, we want... Oh, we didn't want some. Like, the screen is lagging from how many enemies there are on screen. My screen is lagging. The game is lagging from how many enemies are on screen. It's kind of ridiculous. And, like... 
But yeah, Fire Dragonite, great item to have because it makes you basically a monster. Literally, literally a monster for. Okay, sure. Wow. Uh, yeah, I'm a bit over leveled. Maybe just a bit. Maybe just a bit. Come on. Jeff, we could have finished this in one turn. If you just landed your hit, no, we wouldn't have to heal this turn. We wouldn't have to heal after this fight if you just landed the hit. But yeah, it looks like it looks like we're just a bit over leveled, which is not great, which is bad, I would say. Oh, look at how slow this is. Because it's like, I want, I, I'm not trying to be overleveled. Like I didn't grind or anything. Okay, so maybe I'm not overleveled. Maybe the enemies in this area are just like super, like, unbalanced to, toward each other. Because Ness is in the Ness is below 100 HP. That hasn't happened without him dying in forever. Like, like it's actually kind of crazy. I'm just gonna go ahead. And, oh my god, this because I'm. Yeah, uh, uh, Ness didn't even max out from that. Ness didn't even max out from that. Yeah, like, I don't know. I, maybe those Vlava guys are just, like, not worth any... This, this was the wrong way. Hypnotized and increases your luck. Is it, like, good arm... Yes, it does. Okay. Cool. Okay, so we're... Oh, we're right here. Okay, this is the right way. Oh, gosh. This is probably the wrong way, because... Uh, it's the easy way to go. There's just so many enemies! Like, did they even try to make the end the spawn right in here? Why? Why you? Like, did they even try to make the... Oh, gosh. Did they even try to make the enemy spawn right in this... Okay. Like... Did they even try to make the enemy spawn right in this, in this area, like... Remotely, like... Like, maybe there's, maybe because it's the last, like, a sanctuary, they're trying to overwhelm you with power and stuff. Level 72. 64. But, like, I don't know. Did your PP just go by 44? What? I had to have misread that. I had to have misread that. Alright. What else we got? Um, let's take on these guys, and we'll call this area clear, and then we will end off the episode because this is getting a bit too far. Oh, no. Kill the soul-consuming flame first because I still don't know if he's a threat or not and I spare it, I'm sorry. And this guy, he sometimes uses a shield like that, so he's definitely not a threat. Because I don't even use PSI on you. I just punch you because like, punching you with Paula does about as much damage as using freeze on you, so... Alright, well, I don't know what's going on, but, like, I, mean, I do know what's going on, but, like, there's some things I'm not sure about. That's not a problem. We'll, we'll deal with that in our own time. As for now, I'm getting the episode off, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.